Here is the urinary bladder. Here is the vagina. And right over here is the uterus. Here is the rectum. And right over here we have the sigmoid colon. One ovary is right over here. Right here is the uterine tube. Right over here is the urinary bladder. And you can see coming into it right over here we have the ureter. And this fold of peritoneum that you see right over here is part of what is called the broad ligament. And right over here we're going to see the uterosacral ligament. We'll see it better from a different perspective. Here is the urinary bladder and it is covered as all these internal organs are by the peritoneum which is over here and is all over on the surface of these organs. Here is the uterus and you can see the ovaries are over here and over here and we're going to see uh, that the ovaries are supported by a number of ligaments one that you can see right over here is the ovarian ligament you see it right over here and right over here we'll see it closer in just a second here is the uterine tube and right over here we see part of the round ligament we can see more of the round ligament right over here and you can see it coming around here and it goes through the internal inguinal ring of the female and goes through the inguinal canal and ends up at the labia majora This is the uterosacral ligament. So you can see this fold in the surface of the peritoneum is there because underneath you have the uterosacral ligament. Here is the ovary. You can see there are a couple of locations where ovulation had occurred, which is represented by those spots. Here is the ovarian ligament, which is going to be uh, connected to the uterus. And right over here, we have the uterine tube, or also known as a fallopian tube. At the very edge, you can see the fimbri of the uterine tube. These are uh, feather-like extensions of the edge of the flaring edge of the uterine tube. The fallopian or uterine tubes are going to go and connect to the uterus right over here. And right over here again we see the round ligament. Ovarian artery is coming off the aorta and the ovarian veins are going to flow into the inferior vena cava. And right over here coming from the kidney, the Cialis structure is the ureter going to the urinary bladder.